The, the background to the study is that um, nodular lymphocyte predominant Hodgkin lymphoma is a pretty rare subtype of Hodgkin lymphoma. It probably only accounts for about 4 to 6 percent of all cases. So by far the majority of patients with Hodgkin lymphoma that you see in the clinic have what we call classical Hodgkin lymphoma. Um, and we know that biologically nodular lymphocyte predominant Hodgkin lymphoma is quite a different entity. So it has a much more indolent behaviour, um, it has a, a tendency towards late relapse and so it almost behaves like an indolent lymphoma. And in fact when you characterise it at a molecular level it has much more in common with non-Hodgkin lymphoma than it does with Hodgkin lymphoma. Many people have, uh, tried, have, have treated this, this entity um, with exactly the same kinds of um, chemotherapy regimens as um, classical Hodgkin lymphoma. For instance, in the German Hodgkin lymphoma study group um, tr uh, studies, uh, patients with uh, nodular LP get treated exactly the same as those with classical Hodgkin lymphoma. But I, I actually think uh, because of the biologic differences, it's CD20 positive, which means rituximab is, is, is a very relevant thing to use means that we can probably do better and we can probably achieve um, superior outcomes um, by using a non-Hodgkin lymphoma type, uh, type protocol.